What is up, my Mardi Gras crew? I'm back with another banger for you. Yes, I am, y'all. And yeah, today we eat mac and cheese. Let's say grace. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. May be nourished to my body. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, so guys, today is National Mac and Cheese Day. So, in the honor of National Mac and Cheese Day, I'm eating some mac and cheese, all right? So, yeah, let's get into this video. Let's, let's get a thumbnail, because I didn't do a thumbnail. I want to find a good place. Let me get a good... Don't forget to... Yeah, that's good. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with everybody you know, please. Please, please hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's videos are posting. I'm trying to push this up to y'all because I got a plate, but I don't think it's going to fit. Well, it's all right. Mm -mm -mm. But anyway, yeah. So today is National Mac and Cheese Day. And so I was like, you know what? I'm going to make some mac and cheese for National Mac and Cheese Day. And I was supposed to have some asparagus and roast, uh, beef pot roast with this. Yeah. Mm -mm. That didn't happen. Oh, God. Y'all got to taste it. You got to taste it. You got to. It's that good. But anyway, um... I was supposed to be doing pot roast and asparagus with this meal, but the asparagus is still in the oven. And I did my pot roast in the Instapot, a, a steam, steam cooker, whatever. My first time doing it like that, and it's not cooking as fast as I thought. I don't know if I'm doing it wrong. If anybody has any suggestions on cooking a beef roast in a, um, pressure cooker <laughs> you can let me know in the comments mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm. Oh, this is so good I wanted to do a video making it, fully making it, but I had so much to do. Like I had to multitask while making this. So there was no way I was gonna be able to film. There was no way I was gonna be able to film making this and, um, and uh, get the th other things done. No way, no way. Hunty. Mm. You know, I want to ask those of you who are not getting the vaccine, have you been vaccinated before, like with? any other vaccine I just wanted to know that because I grew up getting vaccinated um 
So I was just curious about that. I don't know why that popped in my head, but if you uh, if you have not been vaccinated and with, for COVID and you have all these thoughts about it, are you vaccinated with any other uh, vaccines? Or <clears throat> are your children vaccinated? Because I know like in public school, your child has to have their shot records and all that stuff. So I'm just curious. Y'all, this came out so good. I didn't want to eat it super hot out of the oven because I didn't want to be on here like blowing, knowing that stuff's still hot. Cause I be wondering when I see YouTubers eating and they be blowing it. I'm like, if you got that fresh out the oven and it's steaming hot, your two little blows ain't gonna help. At least it don't work for me. So it's cool just enough to enjoy. It's still hot. You can see the steam, but it's not super hot to where I can't eat it. Cause I'm not one of those people that eat stuff super hot straight out the pot. Not one of them people. I can't do it. My dad is, but I'm not. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Probably should have got a spoon. Really get it, huh? Orange juice. <clears throat> this is so good. I think this is like the first time in my life that I'm eating just mac and cheese. <laughs> I know there are families out there that they would eat mac and cheese as a meal. I've never had mac and cheese as a meal, like, you know, by itself. Mm. There was always some type of meat with the mac and cheese. Most of the time, it would be like fried chicken or something. But yeah, there was always a meat with the um, mac and cheese. But I love mac and cheese, so. Mm. It's not bad, but I'm just saying, I've never just had mac and cheese like this. I thought about ordering a, a catering platter, I guess you'll call it, of mac and cheese from Chick-fil-A to do this video, but then I was like, I'm just gonna make my mac and cheese. Mm. And I'm glad I did. Anyway, how y'all doing? How are you guys? How's your day going? Let me know in the comments how you've been. 
Let me know in the comments what you want to see me eating. Let me know in the comments if you want to sponsor a video. Because let me tell you something. If you sponsor it, I'm eating it. Unless it's okra. I'm not eating it. What else? Yeah. For sure okra. I'm not eating it. But pretty much anything else I think I would eat. And I did elbow noodles. Cause down here we do baked spaghetti and cheese. Baked macaroni and cheese, but we say baked spaghetti and cheese, whatever. We use we say both things, but it's still spaghetti noodles. But we make our baked macaroni and cheese with spaghetti noodles. <clears throat> so um but I was wanted to do something a little different for this video something that people are uh people feel is more the norm so that's why i did it like this I've been thinking of a few story times for you guys. Like story times about my life, my childhood, whatever. So, you'll be getting some story times. Don't judge me. So good, y'all. Okay, <clears throat> I'm about to end this because I need to check on my asparagus and my pie roast. But anywho, happy National Mac and Cheese Day. This was a delicious video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you be a bite before you go. I will see you in the next video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. And I love you guys. Peace.